Here we're going from a tertiary alcohol to a tertiary alkyl halide. We know that these reactions occur by SN1, which means we're going to need acid to protonate this hydroxyl group and enable it to leave as neutral water. So chloride will not kick off um, the hydroxy group. That would be an SN2 reaction for a very good leaving group. SOCl2 generally occurs through an SN2 uh, reaction in the presence of, of pyridine and uh, chlorine will not react with alcohols like this. Um, HCl is the correct choice here. Let me work through the reaction mechanism for you. In the first step we're going to have this tertiary alcohol and we want to draw in the lone pairs on the alcohol and hydrogen chloride is an acid that will serve to protonate that alcohol or hydroxyl group. Once the hydroxyl group is protonated, then we have a good leaving group. Okay, so neutral water can leave, and we form the famous carbocation that is tertiary in this case, so that's pretty good. And then we have chloride, which is a negative charge. And that just comes in, gets you bond formation to give you the tertiary element.